The art and science of branding is constantly evolving. And one of the more significant and I think positive developments is that the whole movement around purpose-driven brands is gaining even more momentum. A study this year by Cone Communications Echo Research says that the overwhelming majority of people expect that brands and the companies behind them should be active participants, if not primary drivers, of improving the state of the world. Now, corporate social responsibility and cause marketing have always been part of the mix. But for the most part, they were isolated initiatives. They weren't a core business practice. They weren't part of the brand DNA. And mostly, consumers weren't really expecting a lot of corporations. Now they are. In fact, out of 10,000 people in 10 countries in that study, only 6% said that the singular purpose of a company should be to make money for its shareholders. So what's fueling this movement, this mindset? Well, for the public, it's still about economic turmoil at home and across the world. And it's about growing threats to absolutely every facet of our environment. That combined with the full-on embrace of social media. So we have an empowered, emboldened public, more distrustful of corporations than ever, and realizing that the government is only going to be able to do so much. So the result is that responsibility for profit um, is only part of it. There's also a huge responsibility for people and planet. In fact, the um, Cone Echo study says that that's a reputational imperative. Want to view more relevant thought leadership? Visit www.brighttalk.com.